ladies, this is Tia, and today is the day I am washing my hair and returning back to my natural God-given curls today. Um, I wanted to show you, as promised, my hair before I get ready to wash it. This is my hair again. I Before I show you my hair, I um, straightened it three weeks ago. It was actually three weeks today. Anyway, I wanted to show you my hair real quick before I wash it. Um, and this is my hair having been straightened three weeks. As you can see, it's ready to be washed. <laughs> I hope you can see the gist of it or whatever. I don't know if I'm getting all the length of it in the camera. I'll try to back up a little bit more. But it is tired and ready to be washed. So I want you to see a little bit, make it a little closer. So this is what my hair looks like before. Um, apparently I can't get in all the way in, but anyway, that's it. And then that way you'll get to see my shrinkage and all of that. So what I'm going to do is wash my hair the first time um, with a shampoo that does contain sulfates, and that is to get rid of the silicones that I apply to my hair when I'm straightening. And then after that, I will co-wash um, after using the sulfate-free shampoo or the sulfate shampoo. Then I'm going to co-wash with a um, silicone-free, all of that conditioner. Then I'm going to apply my deep conditioning treatment, which I told you about in a previous video. I will link the video again to show you how I mix it. I'm gonna leave that on overnight. Then I'm going to steam treat my hair um, in the morning. After that, I'll wash all of the deep treatment out of my hair, and then I will come and show you my hair naked with nothing in it, no products, after being deep treated and stained um, before I do my wash and go. And I probably will do my wash and go on camera as well. But anywho, that's what I'm going to go do. Wish me luck, and I will see you soon. Hi ladies, it is me, and now it is day two. Um, I did my deep conditioning treatment um, overnight, then I steamed my hair, and as you can see, my curls are back, and I am very excited uh, to see them. I want to give you all a close-up first. So I'm super de duper excited, one, to be back curly, and then super excited that it doesn't, so far, look like I had any heat damage, but of course, I wanted to deep condition my hair, steam treat it, and allow it to get some moisture back into it before I came back and showed you my curls to give them a fair chance of saying, hey, I'm still here. So I'm getting ready to do my wash and go, and um, as you know, I love uh, curl products, so whenever I'm doing a wash and go, so I'll be using um, the Curls um, Reparative Leave-In Conditioner. I wanted to make sure I said that right because I was about to say the wrong word. But that's what I'm going to be using to do my wash and go. And if you saw my wash and go recently, um, I did this reparative leave-in conditioner and the Curls Gel C um, to go over my curls. But today I'm going to use the Cash Cashmere Curl Jelly um, instead of the Curls Gel C. I've never used this product before, but I wanted to try it. Um, so I'm going to show you, um, of course, do my wash and go, show you it wet. And then once it's completely dry, which will be more than likely tomorrow, then I'll come back and show you on camera to see the whole process. So anyway, stay tuned and um, I'll get started with my wash and go.
Okay, so I am all done. I am again gonna allow this to air dry overnight. Um, I'll probably not tie it up until it's about at least 60 to 70 percent dry. But as you can see, it's all done. My curls, for the most part, pretty look look really darn great. I'm excited about them. I actually think that they look really good considering um, me having straightened or whatever. So um, I'll get a little closer so you can see. So anyway, I'll see you um, tomorrow. I'll come back and show you my hair once it is 100% dry. And um, until then, have a great night and I'll see you in the morning.